stopping from editing Tia. Okay, so here's the thing. My gel did not dry mm-hmm. properly. And so it looks white in my hair. Excuse that. Ignore that. I'm, I was going to redo the video because I was. And then I was like, girl, it's day 16. We got two more days of Vlogmas. Get the people the real and raw. <laughs> okay. So don't be in the comments like, ew, there's something in your head. Your mama. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, so that's what that is. Okay, without further ado, enjoy the video. Bye. What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is T. Louise for those of you that don't know. And if you do know and you're returning, what's poppin'? How are you? Welcome to Vlogmas Day 14. <coughs> 15. Today we are going to be doing a Christmas edition this or that. So I'm going to say various things and choose between this or that. And then in the comments, you guys can do um, some answers as well. I want to see what you guys would say. So um, choose your perfect Christmas day. Christmas day lie in. So like sleep in a little bit or early rise for presents. When I was a kid, I would say obviously early rise for presents. But now that I'm an adult, ah. Uh, I feel like I could chill, you know, I could, I could, I'm gonna be up, I'm gonna be awake, but I'll probably be scrolling on my phone, chilling until like everybody's ready to come out and open up gifts. Um, fun fact, we have a Christmas tradition where we open up one present um, the night before on Christmas Eve, which is super fun. Um, and I usually try to get like a really good gift so that I can um, kind of like know what I'm getting myself into through for the next day when I'm opening the rest of my presents. Um, my mom sometimes tries to trick us and gives us like not necessarily a gag gift, but like a gift that's like, okay, you know, <laughs> on that Christmas Eve. So then we're like, man, you know. Um, but yeah, so like, for example, we've gotten like socks before as like a little that's what we got to open the night before which was not fun but you know it is what it is the socks are helpful and handy um, okay hosting christmas or visiting others i am a homebody at this point in my life so i'm gonna say hosting christmas we hosted thanksgiving here and it was such a blast i couldn't imagine trying to host christmas here right now um just because i don't feel like we're prepared to do so if they are and if there's anybody that's ever in need of somewhere to go or somewhere to hang out our house is always made ready and available <laughs> um dress up for christmas or pajamas all day both um, I can be in my pajamas for most of the morning, but then of course y'all already know I'm coming with the content. So I'm going to want to get a picture and I'm going to want to be cute. So yeah, both. Um, Christmas with family or Christmas with friends. I'd say mixture of both. Uh, friends have become family and family are, is just like essential. Like family is forever. It's never going anywhere. So I say a mixture of both. <laughs> Um, open gifts one by one or open gifts at the same time. I like opening gifts one by one just so every person gets like that little moment of like, you know, the spotlights on them. Um, but yeah, I feel like me and my brother, we do, I like to do it one by one, but he's just like, let me open my stuff. So yeah, <laughs> it is what it is. Uh, presents before dinner, or presents after dinner, obviously presents that morning. We're not even talking about dinner. Dinner's not even a thought, okay? We're doing presents that morning, okay? And then that way we can go ahead, clean up, put the things where they belong or put the things back up under the tree until, you know, for the rest of the day. Who's waiting till dinner? Unless I was talking about Christmas Eve dinner, then child. That's it. Um, go out for dinner or cook dinner at home. I feel like places are closed on Christmas, right? Or at least that's Thanksgiving. I don't know. I wouldn't necessarily go somewhere. Just unless I'm going to like a friend or family member's house. I just feel like cooking at home is just like more special. Hmm. I've never done it. So, yeah. Uh, traditional Christmas dinner. We have done a mixture of any and everything. So I'd say whatever takes your fancy. Um, sometimes we like to be traditional. Um, sometimes we like to do a seafood boil. Like it just honestly depends. So, yeah. 
dinner before Queen's speech, dinner after Queen's speech. Again, I don't, who's the queen? Thank you. Table seating plan or sit where you like. Table seating, of course. What, are, what, are, what do you think this is? Do you think this is a barn? No, I'm just kidding. No, but I just love being like super like extra and just doing, doing the most. I like to do the most. <laughs> Everyone stays over, peace and quiet overnight. Everyone stays over, bring on the fun, bring on the people, bring on the loud noises and the laughter and the chaos. I love it all, okay? That's why I absolutely, our house was like packed. It was hectic in here on Thanksgiving, but in the best way possible, like our family getting together, hearing everybody laughing, sharing stories, being silly, being goofy, singing, I mean, just like, I just love the vibes and it makes me really excited to be able to start my own family one day because I want a big family um, so that we can contribute to the craziness that is going on <laughs> within the Cooper family. <laughs> okay, another this or that. It says Christmas music or Christmas movies. I cannot choose either. I'd have to say both. Don't ever torture me like that again. Thank you. <laughs> um, store bought gifts or handmade gifts. I am not a DIY girly, so I'm gonna have to say the store. I've definitely tried my fair share of like homemade gifts. And yeah, they gave what they needed to give at the time, but like, is that a choice? A preference? No, I don't, I'm not that great at like crafty things. I'm just, I don't have that talent, unfortunately. Um, and I genuinely want to give people something that they would like and enjoy and want forever. And not just something that has sentimental value just because I made it, but like, it also might be mistaken as trash one day. I don't, you know, listen, my crafting skills is that bad. So please don't, let's not, okay. Um, eggnog or spice cider? Um, it just depends. I love cinnamon things, so either or, I could do either or. But like, I cannot do eggnog too much. It's like way too milky and like thick. Mm -mm, no. And then the spice cider, it just gets nasty. Mm -mm. Let's say both, just like in moderation. There we go. Gingerbread sugar cookies. Sugar cookies! I love me a good gingerbread. Don't, don't hate. Also, oh my gosh, I went to Trader Joe's and I got those gingerbread snap cookies that you guys were talking about. All the Trader Joe's girlies were talking about. Bust. They are so good. There's just so many in a pack. I can't finish them by myself, so. Yeah, but they were so, so good. Um, real tree, fake tree. I'm gonna have to say fake tree because I've never had a real tree. It's a wonderful life or a Christmas story. A Christmas story. It's just so legendary. Like, how could you not? But then also, if we wanted to take away both those answers, the Grinch. How the Grinch stole Christmas every single time. The original, Jim Carrey one. What? what? The animation is great, don't get me wrong. But Jim Carrey, that man ate down. Okay, he knew what he was doing. He played his part well, and I love the Grinch. I love, anyways, I love him. <laughs> elves or snowmen? Um, I'm gonna have to say elves. Elves are just fun. Snowmen, I don't really, I mean, aside from Frosty, like who else do we give props to being a snowman for? No one, yeah, but we always are talking about elves. So yeah, I'm gonna go with elves. Um, white lights, colored lights, white lights all the way. Big presents, little presents. It depends. Oh, it honestly depends. Jingle bells or deck the halls. Ooh, that's hard. I'm gonna have to say jingle bells, but I love them both. Um, Elf or Home Alone. My brother's obsessed with Home Alone, so if I don't say Home Alone, he'll be upset. But we like both, but he's like obsessed with Home Alone. Um, give a gift or receive a gift. Honestly, giving gifts is the way to go. Um, I absolutely love when I give somebody a gift. I just watch their face to see are they as excited as I am that they're receiving that gift. Um, so yeah, giving gifts is just like the best. Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. Ooh, this might be controversial, but Christmas Eve is like, it's just the dreamiest night ever 
the whole day is just beautiful to me but like especially at night so our family what we do on christmas eve we all gather in the living room and i have um a little fort or whatever and we get us some chinese takeout and we post up in the living room for like christmas movie marathons and we watch all of our favorite movies um and we try to see who can stay up the longest and um, nine times out of ten it is me that is knocked out first and then my mom or my brother or but lately my brother has been beating my mom and my mom has gone to sleep before him um which is really funny so christmas eve is always my favorite i love christmas day obviously it's christmas but like christmas eve just feels like amazing and then the next day is christmas because the day after Christmas is just like a regular day and then we go back into the regular swing of life so I think I love Christmas Eve especially more because right after the magic is another day full of magic which is super cute so yeah okay last two ice skating or sledding neither I don't do either of them um, but ice skating looks really fun to watch and lastly rewind to the first christmas or fast forward to your 40th christmas considering the fact that i am not 40 yet i'd have to say rewind to my first christmas i don't know what that was like but it must have been a great time because i've always loved christmas so yeah but that was today's video and I want you guys to tell me some this or that answers um, but yeah thank you guys so much for watching be sure to like comment share and subscribe I love you guys we are almost to 500 subscribers which is so amazing so I just want to say thank you guys from the bottom of my heart uh, for following along on the journey you guys are amazing and I wouldn't be here without you so I hope you're having a beautiful vlogmas season and that you are preparing for Christmas with your loved ones your family your friends um, and that you're just doing well mentally I hope you are doing well okay I love you guys and I will talk to you soon bye I just wanna wish you